everyone and welcome to Norris Cove. I'm Yoshida here at the Cove. We do budgeting, finances. I plan out my life either minimal or functional and if that sounds like something that you are interested in please stick around and also consider subscribing but today we will be um, planning my week I haven't done a plan with me in a while I have my stickers I know it's a lot um, and I have these stickers um, that will be coming soon I'm shooting for this week but they're business uh, teeny icons. I'm working on a business bundle and I want to also have maybe some stickers to go with it. So um, I did a flip of this A5 planner that will be out on Wednesday. It is Saturday, which is the 11th of February and it's 11 o'clock at night and I'm filming this. I was supposed to do it earlier, but I just, I'm tired. I was tired. So in my flip, I was saying that I have a couple of weeklies, in my weekly section. This is kind of like a pre-planning section, um, kind of like my weekly dashboard. And I don't know, I kind of like it for slow weeks, but I'm also just using it just to jot things down so that um, until plans become final, all that great stuff, and then I'll plan into my regular weekly. Um, for the past two weeks, I've been using the cloth and paper weekly, which I love, their time schedule, I love that. And now that I'm in A5, I love it even more because I have more room. So that was the week before last, that's this week. I'm going to move this. But this week, um, I have my weeklies and I'm gonna plant in my weeklies. I don't have a whole lot of, I do have some time things going on, but that's why I have these sections separated. This is on my website, but um, there's a different font. I don't have the thin imaginary lines here. Um, I just kind of made this for myself and I'm gonna eventually get it in the shop. So it'll be coming soon. So let's take that out. And I've been kind of planning my weeks off camera only because I wanna make sure um, that, you know, I have like, what I'm going to do kind of laid out and I'm playing with these um, weeklies so yeah I'm just going to stick this in my planner to the side okay dokie so we're going to start with Monday Monday is the 13th right here so I'm just going to go through and date my planner and we're working on the week of the 13th through the 19th. So I still need to pull out my planner. I'm gonna just keep referencing it, reference, uh, referencing it. <laughs> I think I'm saying that right. Um, but the first thing I like to do is my schedule. So what do I have? What days do I work? Um, Monday is my coworker's birthday. Um, I don't know if I'm working Monday morning or just Monday evening. So that's the first thing that I do. So I'm gonna put down work and I'm just gonna put um, 2.30 is the time. So I'm gonna go through each day and just put my work schedule. So now that I have my work schedule, I go and look at appointments, um, doctor's appointments, things like that. And I had, let me slide this back in, on, my weekly little dashboard thing here's everything so now i can kind of take these off write them in and i'll probably still stick them back in until the appointments have passed because here i have taxes on um the 16th which is thursday but i'm gonna have to reschedule it because um i mentioned that i have to have surgery so i had to move some clients around to um, accommodate so I'm gonna see if I can go later but I'm gonna stick that back into the dashboard but I'm not gonna put it down um, and then I do have my surgery on Friday so time things I kind of try to put over here in this box so I'm off Friday um, I have to be at the hospital at 9 a.m. so I'm just gonna put 9 a.m. hospital but my surgery is at 11:30. Spell surgery wrong. So that's Thursday. I have a doctor's appointment at 2.20. And 
and I like to just kind of put 12 because I'm going to go early. And so, again, I stick that back in there. So, next up is bills, okay? <laughs> then I start talking about my bills and what's due. I'm going to pull out some stickers. Um, these are from my shop. I don't know if I've put those in there. And then those... Okay, so I know on the 15th, I have my car note due. So I'm going to find a car sticker. Let's see. That um, with the dot sticker, one of my favorite dot stickers, which is the um, ice milk. And all of these stickers you can find in my shop except for the business ones. The business ones, like I said, they're new, they're coming soon, and I like to just test them out. So here we have my car notice due Wednesday. And I'm gonna use this sticker. <clears throat> these are new in the shop as well. And see, these are, I think this is the ice. No, this is sand. And then up under here, I put car note. Um, Monday, I have a bill due. I'm just going to take another. Well, I want to switch it up because I had a bunch of these in my calendar. And they were cute and all, but <laughs> I was like, I got too many of them. So I'm going to switch it up and just use this bill due sticker here. Monday. And that's uplift. Okay. Um, let's see what else is due. On Friday, we have Barclays due. Um, that's a credit card. So I'm going to take another one of these and a credit card. <clears throat> going to use this one on Saturday. I know that it's Barclays. So I'm just going to put here. Those are all the bills that I know. I also have booth rent due, which I never really write this down because I know <laughs> that it's due. Okay. And let's see. I've done appointments. I've done my schedule. I've done bills. So now I get into anything else, gathering, stuff like that, or things to get, things to buy, things to pay. Um, next week is sub week. Subs go out. Again, I'm having surgery on Friday, so I know I won't be doing anything Friday, which is the 17th, which is they normally start to go out. So I may have to do some things here. So I'm going to put over here. I'm going to let this be the business section part of it. So I'm going to whip out some of my business stickers. Um, I'm trying to see. And these are kind of oops that I printed. So um, I need to do a newsletter. I'm always forgetting to do the newsletter. So I'm trying to find this. And I'll get those. Um, I'm going to give the business a different color. So I'll use these. And I think these are oops because I don't think this is the actual color taupe. Um, also, Monday, we do our budget. So let's pull one of these again. I can actually put that over there. This is business, but this is really just social media. So we do our budget plan. So I'm going to use this sticker from the new business thing. So like I said, subs usually start shipping out on Saturday, but I may go into Monday because of my work schedule. But I'll be doing possibly some shipping and some things early in the week but on the safe side i'm going to put my um shipping on sunday 
I don't know that it means boxes are going out on Monday. So, that, oops, wrong place. I'll put it here on the business side. And let me find the box. I do need to contact the vendor. It's not about this month. I just need to follow up with them. I follow up with them today, but I need to follow up with them on they said something shipped out so I'm gonna see it'll probably be for later in the year but I need to make a follow-up with them so I'm just gonna put phone call use this and I'm gonna do that on Tuesday and then I think that's it I should be getting some mail but I also need to do some designing so I'm gonna use this um, because I have some stuff I'm working on for my business webinar, like um, I'm gonna do some of that on Tuesday. So I'm gonna put that here. Um, I've announced it on Instagram, but the graphics should be coming soon. I'm doing a, a free business webinar. Um, some of you may know I have the podcast and it's pretty much business related. I got great feedback from it. And matter of fact, I need to do the podcast so that I can um, announced there as well so I'd already said the podcast was coming back so I'm putting that over here and I think I have a microphone here it is see on this one so that lets me know that's the podcast okay so I put in design business webinar graphic I have the webinar is straight good to go I'm getting some feedback on it um, but I just need to do the graphics for it. I already have the date kind of set aside. So yeah, I'm ahead of the game for once. I'm excited. But um, yeah, so I got to do the vendor follow-up on Tuesday, podcast on Tuesday as well. And I think that's it. Um, like I said, Sunday, I'm going to try to do a little relaxation, but I'm going to do a little prep work through here and I need to do the announcement once I get this together let me pull out my business icons so <clears throat> once I get the graphics done I'm going to do the announcement so that's like a month away that gives people enough time to put it in their planners their calendars their schedule but I'm going to do the business webinar webinar announcements on Wednesday since the graphics will be ready, well, Tuesday. And that falls up under business, so there we go. Um, I think that's it. Oh, 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 oh. There's a sales sign that kind of reminded me. Um, I still need to put up the items from January's box. I am so behind. So I'm going to do that as well. And also on the 18th subs for March start, the 16th subs end. So I do need to make a note of that. And Sunday, I'm going, like I said, I'm gonna be doing a little bit of packing. Oh, and then I need to find, I need this. There is like a target button on here, but then I need this alarm clock because this is a deadline on I think the 15th that's the last day I can do my Etsy orders that should be over here I'm just gonna put it right here I do know I need to use the bank icon because I need to transfer some money on Wednesday so let me get that And I was using my ice milk icons. When I tell you, I mean dots. I love this color. This is just my color. Um, both days on the 15th and the 16th because the 16th will technically be my last day of work. So I'm going to have to maneuver some money to um, get all my bills paid and stuff like that because I'm not going to work. But Thankfully, um, my customers were accommodating some of them, um, but I understand some not being able to be, you know, accommodating. So 
it's all good. Um, let me see if I can find another bank. And I did. I did. These are like my most used stickers besides my um, icons and dots. So since my car note is doing Wednesday, I have like a car savings and I keep saying I'm going to do a digital envelope breakdown of how I do my digital, I mean, how I do my digital envelopes. So I haven't been doing cash stuffing, but I have been adding, um, using, transferring money into, um, out of the many accounts that I have to pay my bills and kind of keep up with stuff. It's been working for me, especially with this new car note. Um, I'm going to put another design here. Next, like Sunday, I'm kind of leaving clear. I don't want to bulk that up. I'm not just going to be writing things down. One thing I've learned in planning is to not just um, write things down, just to be writing them down to fill up your planner because it it just doesn't make sense. And you'll, you're not going to get the stuff done. So, blah, blah. <laughs> so, what I'm going to do now on this particular insert, I like to list like next week, this week, to buy or things like that. But now that I have that dashboard thing, I really kind of don't need this. I could do a to buy. So, I'm going to look to see if I have any like to buy stickers or anything like that. Okay, so I found these script stickers that... Um, <laughs> never made it to the shop is basically the size of them, the size of the sheet, and this is just not my sheet size, so that's the reason why they're here. Um, I have a payday sticker, and I normally get paid from either Etsy or Shopify on Tuesdays, so I'll put that over here, over here, because I'm sure I got something to buy this week. And right now, what I can think of is I need to get some tarp for a mattress to go out so that the trash people will pick it up. And, of course, we need groceries. And then I may make a subsection of some things here. Um, let's see what else. So far, those are the only two things I'm thinking that I need to buy. Oh, I've been wanting to get some peroxide. Some soap. Okay, and I realized that I didn't do like chores. So we have laundry to do. <sighs> um, that's gonna be like a twice a week thing. I'm normally do something tomorrow, which is Sunday, and also Monday. Um I have a cell phone bill due one of these days. I think on the 14th. I just happened to look at this cell phone and realized I had a cell phone is due. And it may be who knows. Um, and then I do need to, I'm looking at this and I need to do an IG live because of the announcement. So um let me do that on Wednesday. Okay, you guys, so we're done. This is what it's looking like so far. So I'm doing this insert this week and I will work on getting this one in the shop. And like I said, however, I do like the ones from Cloth and Paper because I am more of a vertical girl, but I also like this one. I like the layout and everything. So here we are. This is my plan for the week. Um, minimal, functional, all that great stuff. Um, and sometimes what I'll do is, because I don't really need to daily plan right now, I don't have a lot going on. Now, probably like um, Wednesday or Thursday, when I'm working on sub stuff, I may go into a daily because that's normally what happens. It's a busy day, I got a lot of stuff to do. But like on slow days, I just write in things that need to be done ahead of time or take some stuff from my little inbox or 
whatever here like here i have some things like i'm starting my workouts update website finish business bundle so i'll take things from here and move them over here as i remember them or as they need to be done and then i'll pick a day that they can go on and i'll just look at my lighter day and normally it seems like these two days are my light day i have a little um room for business over here on the 15th but i also have a deadline to meet on something so which should have been over there matter of fact let me take this i'm gonna use these strips these are from the budget box we do have some extras they are in the shop and i'm just gonna do this and that will basically um remind me of this deadline because it's going to be highlighted and that I want it to be on this side pretty much. So that'll just draw my attention to it. And that's what I love about stuff like this, like the transparent stickers and stuff like that. And um, planning is that it kind of draws my eye to stuff that needs to be drawn. That color just kind of pops up to me. So yeah, so that's that. And we're done. Um, as usual, if you enjoyed today's video and you love to see more content like this for myself, please do me a favor, hit the subscribe button. Also hit that notification bell. And if you're new here, do me a favor, leave me a comment. Let me know that you're new here so that we can welcome you to the Cove. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.